Hi, I'm Charlie from Charlie's Kitchen, the kitchen that doesn't have a cook or a chef. Why, I'm Charlie from Charlie's Kitchen. And our, our special guest today is George Capagnara from Il Dega. And he's one of my favourite performers. In fact, he was wonderful. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. How can you be Charlie? You're George. I'm Charlie. What does it say here? Charlie's Kitchen, but this there is you go. my kitchen, my home. Hey, I'm Charlie. That, that, that's my... <laughs> I'm Charlie from Charlie's Kitchen. What are you doing here? You we should got, be shopping. We've got George coming hey. to cook for us. No, he, he's coming to cook. He's here. He's just giving me right, the recipe. So I'm going to do the I'm, cooking I'm, and I'm, the shopping I'm, today. I'm going to go shopping. Okay. okay, you stay here. I'm going shopping. I'll see you in a minute. All right, okay. I'll be right back. Can I touch that machine? What is that? Looks good. Welcome back everybody, I'm back from shopping and I'm here with George, obviously we know we're here with George. George, welcome to the show. Thank you, thank you for the cafe latte oh, no, made no. by Caterina. Caterina, right. Your wife. Yes. Beautiful so, girl. Oh, she's lovely. Sounds like a drag queen though. What's it's going only, on there? She's got a little bit of something wrong with her voice. Oh no, she's not a Rod Stewart fan or anything. No. Bonnie no. Tyler. Oh no, no, she does like it. It's yeah. a <laughs> Okay. It's but we're there. having our coffee because you're going to make girl, though. Lovely oh, okay. girl. She's and she's brought in all these great cakes yes. to make me feel more comfortable yes, here. Yes, yes. Tell us something about these cakes. Well, because it's Greek she, and it's coming Well, she didn't Easter. know what they were called. She was asking me, what are these? What, what, these are Kuluria. You know who we have to thank for these? Who? Jim, Jim Papa Vasilio. Jim. But, they, they Dimitris made Papa Vasilio. Vasilio. Yeah. <laughs> Vasilio. <laughs> um, yeah, so you have these for Easter. They're Kulurake. Thank you, Jim. Yeah. And this is the big Kuluri. We just call it Tsureki. Tsureki. So that's a kind of... Uh, it's a great That's like panettone. It's actually it? panettone. But we it? actually eat ours. We don't give it to another person. <laughs> okay. We actually eat it. You know how your panettone makes the, the rounds? The rounds, it goes okay. back to the original owner. Yeah, you owner. have to take the date off because, you know, it's... it's, it's like Joe Vardy says, it's like a big muffin, isn't it, a panettone? Oh, oh, yes. Well, this is sort of like, you want to try some of this? Yeah, we'll try some. Yeah. Um, we'll just break and it this off. is great for dunking, you know, while we've got our As coffees well. here. Yeah. And this is an Easter cake. You have it after Easter. Of course, you don't have it before Easter because us Greeks, we fast. Okay, for so 40 days and 40 nights. Everything in Greek tradition is 40 days. Everything? You have a baby, you can't leave the house for 40 <laughs> days and 40 nights. Easter, you can't eat meat, cheese, eggs, fish, oil, have sex, have sex with oil and meat and cheese and fish. <laughs> but so 40, basically, it's 40 days and 40 you're on you the diet. Fast. I mean, you guys, you give up one thing. What did you give up? Last chocolate. Year? Give up chocolate? <laughs> Did he, Katerina? I bet he didn't. They didn't even do that. Okay. Well, we have to give it up. And then oh, on no, the 40th day, we go to the church. We did the, the blockies around the church. We did the laps around the church. I don't know if there's a Greek church in Balcata. Is yeah, there? there is. Yeah, you did the laps around the, the old market garden area. And <laughs> you crack the eggs, you crack the eggs, you have a couple of these in the car on your way home, and by then you're starving. You really want to eat something. Yes. And what do you get? Sheep's guts. You get... Oh, you, get, you get magyaritsa, it's, it's gut soup. Give me a steak, Grandma, I'm hungry, it's been 40 days. I'm going to make a thing called Mars Bar Slice. This was... Uh, it's your recipe, obviously. No, it's not my recipe. Okay. It was given to me by an ex-girlfriend. Ex-girlfriend, okay. Yeah. We'll let, we'll, you want to we'll, know we'll, what nationality she was? Okay, well, what was she? Skippy the Bush Gangaruda. Ah, that's But, yes. Aussie. But hey, it's not, that's not the reason... <laughs> it's not the reason. ...why we didn't get married. Okay. Uh, why we didn't get married. Okay. Anyway, Doesn't my matter. parents never knew about the relationship anyway. But okay. then she taught me, she gave me the cake. This is one of my favourite cakes. I haven't cooked it for 20 years. Shall we start? Yes, it's good. It. I love Mars Bar. What's first? I oh, know, I haven't cooked it for 20 years. Oh, but I no. think what we have to do <laughs> yes. is melt the Mars Bar, which yes. is the secret ingredient. That one there, yes. It's 90 grams of butter. We'll do okay. that. That's we'll... 90 grams of butter. Okay, we'll do that straight okay. away. We'll put that together in a pan. Let's go. Let's add our ingredients. Okay, I'm of course, ready. we need some butter. Butter? Here you okay, go. so that's 90 grams of butter in there. And three Mars Bars. A <laughs> Blas. <laughs> There's a Blas for you. Sure, a Carlton <laughs> Football Club. Of course, a lot of Italians and Greeks okay. like Carlton. Okay, what else? And then you've got to give me something to stir it with. Hey, what are you doing? What did I do wrong? Here. Yeah. That oh. oh, that's the old. Uh... That's the old, you know. Oh, yeah. As, How many times do I have to tell you, <laughs> don't cook skipping the bush? I got all the food in my house. <laughs> okay. I do all the cooking. You just shut up. Oh, that looks so, so good. And why do we have to up. do this first? Oh, no. Why are we cooking the dessert? Yeah, we're cooking first. the dessert first, yeah. Um, because. You have to leave this really, if you're going to cook this at home, 
you've got to leave it overnight. Oh, it's got to set. Oh, so okay. it's got to set overnight. Okay. You can make it all up. I, mean, I just want to eat it now. You can hear it crackling. It just smells so good. <laughs> yes, it does. You want to have a bit of a go? Yeah. Just mix it up. Okay. And once once you've mixed it up, then we put it into our, our tin, our cake tin that we yes. have here. And then we put some... Uh, Grease paper. Some grease paper. Yeah. Uh, has that got something to do with me? No. Okay. Um, <laughs> we don't want to upset anyone at home. You know oh, no, I mean? no. It's the last thing we want to do is upset people at home. Because we love you guys. We really do. <laughs> Especially you, uh, Anastasia. One of my greatest fans out there. You know I'm talking to you. All right, we'll just, just pour it, it in Just there. pour it in and you kind of flatten it out. So... Oh, oh let me help you. Again, so. remember I'm an actor. Okay, um, okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, you're doing great. We get people to do this for us. Someone <laughs> said the other day that I got married to a Greek girl because she does all the cooking for me. That's not true. It's not true. <laughs> Is that right? Yeah, flatten it out. I, I can have what's left. Oh, over. you can add it here, you can have the spoon. That's mm. right. Why am I doing all the work all of a sudden? <laughs> Keep I, going. I wish <laughs> when my mum used to give me the wooden spoon, I wish it came with this on it because I just hit me on the tongue. Just whack, whack me on the tongue. Okay. okay. You're yeah. good at this. Of course I'm good at this. You should have your own cooking show. That's an idea, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, now it's time for the icing. Butter, or in Italian it's burro. In Greek it's vutiro. That's coming up nicely. That's beautiful. That's good. Okay, so we're going to melt this down. You can also microwave this. Yes. If you but want. This is the old fashioned way. It's always this better. This is the old fashioned way. Yeah. Plus I don't, I'm not good with microwaves and I don't really I know you can warm up the baby's milk in the microwave and, you know, but this is this seems like a nicer way of doing things. Yes. It looks good too. I mean, you can just, I mean, how fun is cooking? I mean, the cleaning part's bad. I don't like that bit. But how cool is cooking, you know? And a lot of, especially guys out there, but a lot of people these days don't cook anymore. It's such a nice thing to do. Hey, this is just like bricklaying. <laughs> Imagine if you made a house out of Mars bar slices. Oh, no, it wouldn't last. <laughs> wouldn't last. All right, who's going to do the smoothie bits? Okay. Our food. Smooth it out. Smooth okay. it out. So, smooth it out. And I'll help too. Um, Here we go. Quite show. I love this show. So this is ready to go now. It's ready to go. It's ready. And now it doesn't have to be perfect because you know what happens at the end? You chop it up in just slices and you just, in the end you eat it. Yes. But yeah, you chop it up and you present it beautifully and it looks okay. fantastic. So I'm going to put this in the fridge. Yes, please. And it will set. We're going to go to a break. Mm -hmm. We'll see. Stay tuned. Is that how we Don't say? go away. Don't go away. We'll be right back. Right back. Right back. Okay. <laughs> this is Charlie's Kitchen. Yeah, we'll be back. No chefs, no cooks.